Before we begin, make sure to smash that like button, subscribe to our channel, and click the notification bell for more amazing videos. Man biking around the world learns he's not alone. Traveling alone can be scary. You may find yourself in unfamiliar territory and surrounded by people speaking a different language. Plus, it can get pretty lonely when you have no one to share your journey with. So when this adventurous man grew tired of the same old, same old, he intended to travel through Europe with a buddy. But when he suddenly found himself going at it alone, he struggled to keep himself motivated. Until he crossed paths with someone who changed his entire trip. In a small town on the Scottish East Coast lived Dean Nicholson, a man in his 30s who only ever wanted one thing, to see the world. Unfortunately, he didn't have the money for that, but he did have a plan. You see, Dean was sick and tired of his normal life, as living the 9-to-5 grind didn't suit him. He had no problem with the idea of giving it all up, his house, his job, and his hometown. Since he didn't have the means to buy a bunch of plane tickets or book fancy hotels, it wasn't easy for him to travel to all his desired destinations. But there was another way. Dean was fit and owned a high-quality bicycle. With a friend, he grabbed a globe and thought about where they wanted to go. They wanted to see France, Greece, Montenegro, Bosnia, and anywhere else in the European mainland where their bikes could take them. In September of 2018, they had it out, biked through England and took the ferry to France, where they immediately ran into trouble. The friends had to run from a pack of wild boars. That danger got them both thinking about their futures. This was the breaking point for Dean's friend, and he abandoned their plans and headed back home. But Dean refused to give up on his adventure and pushed on, now completely alone. The following days were a bit lonely, but then that all changed. One day he heard a heartbreaking cry coming from the side of the road. Though he almost kept pedaling, Dean's natural curiosity took over and he stopped to investigate. A beautiful kitten was dumped in the middle of nowhere, and now it looked up at him with pleading eyes. She rubbed against him, showing him love, and he knew he couldn't leave her behind. After a quick shuffle with his biking and camping equipment, the cat could ride up front and enjoy the views as they continued their journey together. Dean named her Nala after the character in his favorite movie, The Lion King. What made Nala so special was that she was fearless and entirely trusting. She rode on the bike, slept in tents, jumped into canoes, greeted people on the way, and loved her new best friend more than anything in the world. Everywhere they went, people stopped and pointed at Nala, asking to pet her or take her picture. After all, it's not every day that a cat rides a bike. Dean even bought her a special bag with a window for when she gets tired of the attention. Still, it would soon be time to cross the Montenegro border, and Dean was worried they wouldn't let Nala through. So he got her dewormed and vaccinated and smuggled her into the country successfully. The clever kitten didn't even make a peep. However, trouble came not long after when Nala began to wheeze and cough. The rain and cold had given her a lung infection that needed immediate attention. So Dean found a vet as fast as he could. He couldn't lose his new friend now. Nala's treatment meant the two had to stay in one place for a while, a place that was dry and warm. Staying still made Dean uneasy, but he booked a hostel where he stayed a few weeks, anything for his feline friend. Luckily, Nala completely recovered and their trip continued. Things really started looking up and they were making friends wherever they went, friends who even let them stay at their home for free. Of course, Dan and Nala always shared that same kindness with other people and animals they met on the road. They even shared their food with a group of hungry stray cats on a rainy day. It was nice Nala could play with other cats. But perhaps the greatest friend they made was a puppy who needed serious medical attention. Dean got him the treatment he needed and even found a wonderful family to adopt him. While Dean couldn't keep the puppy, he hoped Nala would always stay with him. He even invested in more equipment to keep her comfortable and safe, like a backpack to carry her and a life jacket to take her on canoes. To document his love for the little cat, he even got a tattoo of her paw so she'd be with him forever. Can you blame him? Nala was not only adorable but full of courage and wanderlust, a rare thing for a kitten. Even though Dean never expected to become a cat dad on the road, he was so happy that he took the journey and that they found each other in their loneliest moments. Now they could take on the world together, one mile at a time. Dean was forever grateful that he answered Nala's friendly hello. 
He heard tales of other bikers who also had animal run-ins, except those cases were far more urgent. Please share this story with your friends and family.